Now that the plants have acclimated to the outdoors over the course of several days, as detailed in the previous video, it's time to get them transplanted into the ground. It's rained here about every other day for the past two weeks, so I've had to wait a bit longer than I would really like to get them transplanted, but everything should be okay. The garden has all been tilled, and I've made a small hill for each plant. I will be planting four rows of seven plants each, with two feet in between the plants and three feet in between the rows. And as you can see here, I've reserved this area to the left of the tobacco for a small vegetable garden. You want to be very careful when removing the plants from the plastic trays as to not damage the, the roots that much or to break the stems of the tobacco because they're very fragile. When using plastic trays like this, just push up from the bottom of the plant and gently lift it out of the tray. Place each plant into the hole in the center of the hill and cover them with dirt, including the bottom two leaves of the plant, which should by now already be turning yellow as you're not going to need those anymore. Once you have everything transplanted, you want to water the plants in really well. I mix in a little bit of miracle Grow plant food, the kind for flowers and vegetables, in with my water when I water them in, and it seems to help them get off to a better start. Make sure that the plants are getting water at least every two or three days for the first three or four weeks that they're in the ground. Once they become more deeply rooted, they're a little bit more drought tolerant. In the next video, we'll be covering some general routine maintenance such as weed and pest control.